Okay, hey there, Dana. Uh, we don't need the uh, reheat sappers. Oh man. I definitely don't want two chariots. I don't want two elven hunters uh, either. Or two hawks. This is a bad hand. Oh crap. I messed up Bumble again. Okay, let's just uh, leave them up. We have a poison. Oh, this looks cool. I'm toward the vampire's deck. I don't know if it's good though. I think it's good. Uh, there's like a tier list. If you, if you really care, there's a tier list uh, from the previous season. So you can check that. I don't know if it, it really applies still with the new cards and whatnot. But if you really care, I mean, you can check it out. Yeah. We have a very similar deck. I don't think I have to commit super hard here. I might even go just... I might just even just play the smuggler and go for a, a pass. I think that's what we're doing. Trained Hawk moves me away. But I'm just passing. I don't care about going uh, first last round. He seemed to be playing a Harmony deck. Just for you, love. And he likes the Skirmisher. Over the Booster Dwarf that I am taking. That's fine. Oh man, this is still a terrible hand. <laughs> okay, just try to improve this uh, monstrosity. Percival, shut them back. Shoot them back. Are you gonna pass? Oh crap, really? If this is me now, who was I before? Okay. Was it so plowing crummy in Nilfgaard? Let's go with the fledgling. The waters of Brockelong, the taste still upon my lips. Wait. Can I match him? I can't match him. We need to match him with the Dryads. I'm actually tempted to play the Hero Power. But we're gonna play just Dryads here and wait. It's gonna be tough to match him. Why is he pushing me? I don't understand. This guy's taunting the whole row. I don't think we can justify we can get away with not using Mystic Echo. 
But if we use Mr. Gecko, if I use Mr. Gecko, nah, we gotta use Mr. Gecko here. Although we want instantly uh, game back value. But this is insane. What I did is insane. If he keeps playing, he's just uh, a crazy person. Because, yeah. Very strong board. But I can just like tip it to around, not play anything. The last thing you... I would rather a little bit over invest in a round. Then try to just like not do anything and get punished because we gonna lose like like that. This is still fine. We're gonna have a last round without uh, without the key key cards, but uh, it's fine. We can throw that. I already have a poison. We don't really need a dryad. There's still some good cards in there. Uh, we can pull a Saskia. Opener wise. We can open with a Pafko. He generates two value a turn. Then we can go half elf hunter, maybe a trained hawk. Some Dryads. Let's go with Pafko. I don't have a Dwarf. Okay, let's start with Pafko. I think playing in the back is the right call. Although I have one that's kind of limited to the... Yeah, I have one that's limited to the Ranger and one have that's limited to the... To the front. He might get moved though. So that's that's kind of the reason, like, okay, maybe you shouldn't puff cool because you know he's gonna get shut down. But uh really I didn't expect that card. Uh, we gotta save the poison a little bit. Come on! Why? At this point, it makes a little bit more sense to uh, group up in the melee row. Although, this is probably gonna play, play them the range row. Okay, let's go range row still. Okay. Yeah, I want a Saskia. Maybe not dead last. <laughs> Etrial. That's not a terrible target for a poison. Especially because... We would force out the tiger. I think we have to do it. But then we lose all the elves and Barnabas. Barnabas is already pretty bad. Spider Chicken 9! Hey Dana, what's up? Oh really? He's not playing the Panther? Maybe he doesn't have it. Is that a Purify? He can Purify his own unit. Oh man. I 
In that case, we might as well play the Dryad. What? I don't have Purify. can kill it with the Great Oak, so the Panther is going to be a little weaker. Currently we are pretty screwed already. I'm not even sure what we want. I can Purify. Oh man, Purify would have worked okay. No, we are pretty punished. I'm not feeling too optimistic about my chances here. So we got two harmonies. Uh, for that alone, like, Sasuke is not that great. But not sure what else we can really go for. Of course a Purify would have been decent. Actually, Dwarven Chariot gives me a Dwarf. So, if we should play that and then Barnabas. But before all that, let's just play a Saskia. It's still decent. It's not great. We don't have to have her in a very specific location. She can be just in the back. Let's hurry. Yeah, Dwarven Chariot. I'm, I'm kind of warming up to it quite a bit. Oh, he has that too. Okay, it doesn't really matter where we play it. Only one trigger. And Barnabas finisher. So we are basic... Well, this is gonna be a damn hard game. But he has two more points. Let's see your finisher, mate. Probably gonna be a big tree, and we're gonna lose. Although it's not going to, uh, we lose the big tree if he has that. Didn't he already use that? Uh, no, he didn't. So he has it for sure. Well done. Well played. Very close game. Very very close game. If I purified, we would have been fine. Wow. Who would have thought? Uh, <laughs> games within similar archetypes are basically toss-ups. Is it possible to check his deck? I don't think so. Oh, well played.